There are two types of people, innocent or dirty-minded. But when people are too innocent on the internet, it's actually pretty hilarious. So I guess girls get this question a lot. How far have you gone with a guy? And when you're so innocent, you say, I went to Canada with my dad once. <laughs> They got 250,000 notes. But I think it's great when people are innocent, even though to the rest of us, it seems really funny. What's up, guys? You're watching Reaction Time, and let's look at some more innocent posts on the internet. So this is actually another famous YouTuber. His name is Tyler Oakley. He tweeted out two years ago, just got a bloody nose in the shower. Obviously, I'm fine, but it's just very alarming to look down on your naked body and see blood everywhere. Then when he realized what it actually sounds like, he says, Oh my God, and all the girls in my replies right now. So apparently girls have to go through this every single month. And you guys know what it's called. Tyler Oakley experienced what it would be like if he was a girl. And he didn't even realize it till after all these girls replied to him. So we got a picture of a very giant shredded rib dude and also a very small rib dude. They're actually together. They're a couple. And uh, someone compared them on the internet to this. A mouse trying to eat a giant banana. <laughs> Oh, if you guys are too innocent to understand, please, please keep it that way. We don't want you to become like the rest of us. It says, I don't understand the joke. Why does this have 3,000 notes? These pictures aren't even related in any way. Oh, my sweet, sweet, innocent child. You don't understand. And I really hope you'll never understand the joke. Because once you do, you're like... <laughs> Flashes before your eyes. Oh my god. Please don't demonetize me, YouTube. Now you come to me and you say, I'm Corleone and give me justice. But I just... I don't want to. What's your favorite position in bed? <laughs> Mine is near the wall so I can use my phone while it's charging. Oh my god. It's either they're doing that on purpose as a troll or they genuinely think they ask for the favorite position in bed as in how you lie down. No, no, that's not what they... This is a picture of a bunch of straps. If you guys know where it's from... Did that hurt? You guys know what it means. Someone is very, very kinky. Yeah. It says, hello, MTV, and welcome to my crib. Holy sh**. How many dogs do you have? Sweetheart, no. <laughs> I have been recently informed that these harness thingies are not, in fact, for dogs. Someone says, if they aren't for dogs, then what are they for? Horses? <laughs> oh! Oh, they're not, that's not supposed to go in there like that. Amazing costume. This is one of the most inappropriate costumes you could ever get for Halloween. If you don't know what uh, this uh, vagina, I mean, this costume is, <laughs> then uh, yeah, we're just gonna call it Kuka. See, Kuka is another word for a woman's. Yeah, so we're just gonna call it Kuka. We don't wanna get demonetized. Maybe YouTube doesn't understand what Kuka is. So, uh, this beautiful Kuka. Yeah, another over-sexualized Halloween costume. Um, how is a slice of bacon over-sexualized? If that's a slice of bacon, I'm a potato. This is literally the most innocent thing I've ever seen. It's pretty adorable. Does that really look like a slice of bacon? Right here. Right, right here. Now, every time I'm gonna think of bacon, I'm gonna think of Kuka. Kuka and bacon don't go together. You know how purity is supposed to last like three to seven days? Who is that a that only has to suffer three days? Oh, how freaking long are your classes? The longest period I had was 50 minutes. That's funny. The longest period most girls have are three to seven days. The longest period you have is 50 minutes and it's goddamn algebra. Horrible, horrible, I'm sorry. It turns out cream pie isn't a pastry and the internet is a disgusting place. The power of Christ compels you. You know what's funny? I thought cream pie was actually a pastry too. When people always talk about it, I mean, not always, like who always talks about it? When people always talk about it or refer to it, I generally I only thought it was a pastry. Girl getting cream pie. Like, I thought it was a prank on YouTube where they get a cream pie and just put it on their f Oh, ho! we'll give head for food. Um, how are you gonna eat it with no head though? This is the most innocent thing I've ever seen. Oh my God. How are you gonna eat it with no head though? You really thought they're gonna give head. Like, what you doing up at two in the morning? Me, beating my meat. You guys know what that means. If you don't, keep it that way. Someone says, what is this cooking meme? Is this a chef subculture I don't know about? A butcher subculture meme? But you guys don't understand. You don't understand what beating your meat is? Good. Oh, this one is a little sad. So this guy came home with bruises on his neck, scratches on his back. The girl says, my boo went out with his friends and got beat up. I'm glad he's safe though. He had to stay in the hospital overnight. Just think about it. What guy would punch you in the neck and you only only have little bruises what guy would grab you by the back and scratch you I actually feel bad for the girlfriend she's too innocent that she doesn't know this guy actually cheated on her this is from daddy I got you a shitload load of stuff from Sephora, by the way. Just in case you still hate me for being a dick. Someone says, I wish my dad was like that. And then someone replies, um, I don't think that's her dad, to be honest. Daddy? <laughs> I hate when people ruin the word daddy. Every time someone says daddy now, it doesn't mean what it used to mean. It's not an actual dad. 
It's daddy. Guys, this one is actually hilarious. If you want to see it first, link in the description. It'll take you to all the photos of people who are too innocent for the internet. I'm sorry, guys. If you didn't understand these jokes, uh, that's good. Keep it that way. Hope you stay innocent forever, but it's probably not going to happen. You're exposed to all of this. But thank you so much for watching, guys. Check out the second channel. It's a collaboration channel with me and my friends here. Let's play a short clip. We got water. We got ice. This is all ice. Are you ready? I'm chill, bro. I'm going to slip. That's what it's all about. Go subscribe right now, right here. Or uh, subscribe to Reaction Time if you haven't already. Thank you for watching. Have a good one. And I'll see you next time. Peace out.